Support for Windows 10 officially ends on the 14th of October 2025, but Microsoft has recently announced two free options to enroll in the extended security updates without having to pay a one-time fee. This video demonstrates how to enroll in the Windows 10 extended security updates. The option to enroll in the extended security updates is available for all consumer users. Enterprise users are ineligible for the free options and will be required to pay a much higher price, which doubles each year. It's available to any PC running Windows 10 22, H2 Home, Professional, Pro Education and Workstation editions. Since the enrollment is linked to a Microsoft account, you will need to sign into your Microsoft account to enroll in extended security updates. If you enroll, you will only receive security updates for one extra year. It doesn't include any new features or bug fixes. The enrollment wizard was previously limited to users in the Windows Insider program, but it's now been released to the public, and you should see it in the Windows Update section of the Settings app if you've installed the latest updates. With almost half of Windows users still on Windows 10, Microsoft is concerned that hundreds of millions of users will be left unsupported in a few months' time. Making access to the Windows 10 extended security updates free will encourage more users to keep their PCs secure for another year. On a device running the latest version of Windows 10, you will find a link to sign up for extended security updates. When you click on Enroll Now, you will see a screen that informs you about the enrollment in the extended security updates. If you're signed in with a Microsoft account and have already synced your settings, you should be able to immediately enroll for free. If not, you will see three options. There are two options at no extra cost. You can sync your PC settings data to the cloud by using your Microsoft account. This is the cheapest and simplest option for you to choose. You can use the 5 GB of free storage provided by OneDrive to do this and choose which folders to sync. You can also pay 1,000 Microsoft reward points. This may sound like a lot, but it's equivalent to about one US dollar, and you can earn them through various activities like using Bing, completing quizzes, and making purchases through the Microsoft Store. You might already have more than 1,000 points, allowing you to immediately enroll with your points. The last option is to pay a one-time fee of 30 US dollars or your local currency equivalent. This option is a last resort, and we would only recommend it if none of the other options work for you. After you click the Enroll option, you will see a message confirming your enrollment in extended security updates. On the update page, it will also say that your PC is enrolled to get extended security updates. After you enroll in the extended security updates, your Windows 10 PC will continue to receive important security updates starting from the 15th of October 2025. The updates will be available through the normal Windows Update mechanism and will automatically download and install. The extended security updates for consumers will be limited to one year after the official end of support, so you will no longer get updates after the 13th of October 2026. But it offers a temporary solution if you need more time to move to Windows 11, so we would recommend it if you plan on continuing to use Windows 10 after support ends. If you want to stay up to date with more insightful content like this, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe. To receive notifications whenever our channel posts new content, you can also click on the bell icon.